The first presidential debate is only hours away. What to expect as the candidates square off. Plus, seven officers from our area's largest city honored for their heroic efforts in saving lives. And also ahead on this Wednesday, we'll bring you to a new exhibit near our area that's opening up that'll have you using your brain to learn more about the brain. We'll explain something called Bodies Revealed next. News Watch 16 in high definition. From WNEP, the news station. This is News Watch 16 this morning. And that was Sarah Bynovsky reporting. A science exhibit that's caught the attention of 15 million worldwide, mainly in big cities, is now just a short drive away. A word of warning, some of the images might be disturbing to some viewers. Newswatch 16's Ryan Leckie was granted the first look at the show in Allentown. He's live with the latest. Good morning, Ryan. Hey, good morning, Mindy and Tom. That show debuts here at the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown this coming Saturday. You said it. We got a first look. And with us, the medical director of this exhibit called Bodies Revealed is Dr. Roy Glover. You have your PhD in anatomy. First off, what is this exhibit all about? We learn about it. Well, it's about each and every one of our visitors. We have a body. We live in it 24-7. We don't really understand it very well. So why not come, learn how it works, take better care of it. Uh, your body will thank you for it. Talk to us about these pieces, these bodies, where you get them from. These are at one time real people. They were. Uh, we learn because we study the body. It never lies. It always tells the truth. Bodies were donated. Uh, we prepared them, dissected them. Uh, you can come and see every little detail. Learn as much as you possibly can. And I think the interesting thing, when you see some of these bodies up close, whether it's a skeleton or even sort of this frame, what does this tell us? It tells us that um, our bodies are complex. They're marvelously complex, more complex than any electronic gadget. So uh, the more you learn about it, the more you understand it, the better you're going to be able to care for it. Here are the details on Bodies Revealed, which opens this Saturday at the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown. Tickets are 22 bucks or less, depending on if you're a senior or a member of this museum. And we have much more coming up on Newswatch 16 this morning. You can learn more about the exhibit at WNEP.com forward slash website. Still ahead, guys, we're going to be taking a look at what smoking does to the body, cancer, and how arthritis looks on certain body parts. We're going to be showcasing that with some of these pros still ahead on Newswatch 16. Definitely an inside look. Thank you so much, Ryan. Thanks, Ryan. Well, Mitt Ryan turning the tables on Penn State, why he's suing the university. Plus, officers from our area honored as heroes going above and beyond to serve and protect. Also ahead on this Wednesday, we will bring you inside one of the rarest exhibits that gives you quite an interesting glance at the human body. It's all part of something called Bodies Revealed, and you'll see it live coming up on Newswatch 16 this morning. Newswatch 16. Well, Newswatch 16 this morning is getting the first look at a traveling exhibit that could teach us all about the human body in a way you won't find in a textbook. Newswatch 16's Ryan Leckie is live in Allentown to give us a glance. A warning, some of the images might be disturbing. Good morning, Ryan. Hi, good morning, Mindy and Tom from the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown. It is here where this exhibit known as Bodies Revealed has rolled near our area. And the cool thing about it, it has been viewed by millions of people worldwide. Once really only available in bigger cities, now it is closer to our area, featuring various sections from the nervous system, the respiratory system, and where we are this morning, the circulatory system. With us is Catherine Seymour. What can we take away from this area? You're standing in the circulatory system, which allows you to see the innermost workings of your body, your blood vessels. So there's 100,000 miles of blood vessels in your body. It wraps around the world three times, and this is your opportunity to see them up close. Yeah, who knew that everyone, really most people's blood vessels could wrap around the world three times. And as we take a look around, where does some of this stuff come from? Because this was eventually, I mean, this stuff was taken from real people. Absolutely. This exhibition and all the parts in it come from medical schools throughout China. And so this opportunity to see these donated bodies up close and personal and it's a really cool experience here at Da Vinci Science Center. Such a learning experience. Here are the details on the exhibit itself because it opens this coming Saturday and runs through February 10th. The great thing about it, tickets are 22 bucks or less and there's so much stuff you could take away from it. There's school groups that can visit this place. WNEP.com forward slash websites for more information. With us is Troy A. Thrash, the CEO of the Da Vinci Science Center. What do you think the little ones will get out of this? Well, I'm really excited for the students, the kids in the area, because this whole program is built around the idea that there are some incredible careers in medicine, in healthcare technology as well, 
right here in Eastern Pennsylvania. And so we want all the kids to be able to understand that there's an amazing future for them in healthcare, and this is really just the start. It's incredible. And we're really just starting to show you parts of Bodies Revealed. Coming up on Newswatch 16 this morning, a closer look at some of the effects that smoking can have on the body, what that looks like, and we'll show you some other parts of this interesting display that has been all over the globe, guys. More ahead. It's fascinating. Thank you so much, it really Ryan. really is. Thanks, Ryan. Well, now and also ahead on this Wednesday, Newswatch 16 will give you the first look at an exhibit that gives you a rare look inside the human body. Coming up, we will show you how your breakfast is digesting right now. Newswatch 16 in high definition. Well, science exhibit that's caught the attention of 15 million worldwide, mainly in big cities, is now just a short drive away. A word of warning, some of the images might be disturbing to some viewers. Newswatch 16's Ryan Lucky granted the first look at the show in Allentown. Good morning, Ryan. Hey, good morning, Mindy and Tom from the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown. It is here we are giving you a first look of this exhibit that has traveled the globe and is now closer to home. It is called Bodies Revealed, and it gives you an inside look at the human body that is quite rare, unless you're a medical student or have worked in the field. And what's so cool about this, there's so many factoids as part of this exhibit. For instance, in the respiratory section, did you know by the time you are 70 years old, you will have taken at least 600 million breaths. And from the respiratory system to the digestive system, and we're learning so much with us is Roy Glover. He's the medical director and a PhD in anatomy. So if people are eating their breakfast right now, talk about how is it actually digested? Well, open your mouth, take a bite, down through your esophagus, and then you encounter this amazing complex of organs that live in the same neighborhood. Your stomach, your intestines, your liver, your pancreas, where all of these things are broken down and digested so they can get into your body go through the wall of the intestine, get into your blood, all of the cells of your body, give them all the strength and energy they need. I think the thing that makes this exhibit so unique, these aren't like wax figures, these were once real people, so where do they come from? Well, we work with medical schools in China, the bodies are donated, and then the people there dissect them for us, it takes over a year to dissect one of these bodies, so that we can show people exactly what they Body, their bodies look like. And quickly, we want to take a look over here to give you a sense of what happens if you're a smoker because you can really take away what you're doing to your body if you're maybe smoking or using other products or items, so to speak. Well, we don't put black on these lungs. They get black because of the tars and cigarette smoke. And when you get those into your lung, your lung is the only organ in your body that oxygenates your blood. So if your blood isn't oxygenated properly, you have problems breathing, it compromises the health of your entire body. And I think the fascinating thing, people sometimes sometimes see the black lung, and then they toss out their cigs. Here are the details on Bodies Revealed, the exhibit that opens this Saturday, continues through February 10th at the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown. You can learn more about it. Tickets are 22 bucks or less. All the information at WNEP.com forward slash websites. Much more ahead here on Newswatch 16 this morning. We'll take you into some other areas of the human body, giving you a glance of what it's all about. Thanks to this exhibit that has toured the globe, guys. See you in a bit. Very interesting stuff, Ryan. Thank you. Thanks, Ryan. Well, the fans have spoken. And an exhibit that has toured the world is now closer to home. I'm Ryan Leckie, live in Lehigh, Lehigh County. With this morning, we have a look at a rare exhibit that will showcase the human body like no other traveling show. Plus, we'll explain why girls are born with bigger brains than boys. News Watch 16 in high definition. Newswatch 16 this morning is getting the first look at a traveling exhibit that could teach us all about how the human body works. Newswatch 16's Ryan Lucky is live in Allentown to give us a glance. With a warning, some of the images could be disturbing. Good morning, Ryan. Hey, good morning, Mindy and Tom from the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown. What got our attention about this exhibit, it has been seen by more than 15 people, 15 million people worldwide, and it's now closer to home, really giving you a look at the human body like no other traveling show, featuring everything from the digestive system to the respiratory system, even the nervous system. And we want to answer that question, why are girls born with bigger brains than boys? So, Catherine, tell us. Would you just believe that they're smarter? Actually, okay. Girls are born with bigger brains than boys because when they're born, it counts for 2.5% of their body weight, whereas with boys, it's 2%. It eventually evens out, but from the beginning, girls have those bigger brains. Yeah, that was my next thing. Eventually, as you get older, I imagine it probably just all evens out. Right. Let's talk what else we can learn about here in the 
system. So you're in the nervous system, which is just a cool gallery. You get to see your brain, your spinal cord, how it all works together. Our friend over here lets you see the innermost workings of that system and how you function on a daily basis. And these are real bodies, so how did you guys get them for the show? These are real human bodies. They were all donated through medical schools, and you have a great opportunity to see things like a stroke, which we're looking at over here, as well as different sizes of brains allow you kind of get to see the inside of, of yourself. Here are the details on the Da Vinci Science Center's exhibit known as Bodies Revealed, which gets underway this Saturday, continues through February 10th in Allentown. Tickets are 22 bucks or less. You can learn the specifics of the show, the different parts of the exhibit you can learn from, all at WNEP.com forward slash websites. Finally, quick question, yes. Dr. Glover, yes. PhD in anatomy, how can you tie a bone in a knot? We're looking at the skeletal system. Well, bones are made up of living and non-living tissue. Take the non-living away, leave the living behind, soft, rubbery, tight in a knot. Bones are stronger than a comparable piece of steel. Who knew? We're learning so much stuff. We have much more ahead coming up on WNEP2. High five to you guys. Some smart folks here. And again, Bodies Revealed open now, actually Saturday through February 10th. Guys, I'll see you on the deuce. Okay, thanks so much, Ryan. See you, Ryan. Well, now a science exhibit that has caught the attention of 15 million worldwide drive away. But a warning, some of the images could be disturbing. News by 16's Ryan Leckie live in Allentown with this pretty cool show. Ryan, good morning. Hey, good morning, Tom, from the Da Vinci Science Center. Newswatch 16 was actually granted a first look before any other media in the area to take a tour of what's known as Bodies Revealed. And this gives you a look at the human body really like no other traveling show. It's broken up into eight different sections, ranging from the nervous system to the muscular system. And with us is Catherine Seymour. First of all, what can we take away with this section over here? So you're standing in the muscular system, which is a really unique opportunity to see how balance, strength, and all your muscles work together. So on this specimen behind me, the red is your muscle and the white is your tendon. So it's an up-close look at something you've probably never had a chance to see before. And some of the interesting factoids when you're in here, you can learn how you can lift certain things and how heavy the human body could lift if all the muscles were connected. Exactly. So if all your muscles were working together at one time, you could lift 10 tons, which is just insane to think about. It's a couple city buses. So if, you, if you're strong and work out, we can see if you can get there. Mine don't all work together. That's why I think I can only pull one city bus. But as we take a look at some of these folks around here, these are actually were once real people. Exactly. So everything in the exhibition is real human bodies that has been preserved in this really cool, unique way. They're, they're, you can look at them, touch them, see them up close. And this is a great opportunity for all in the family to come check it out. And these bodies obviously were donated for like medical research and for educational exhibits like the one we're in. Here are the details on Bodies Revealed, which gets underway this Saturday at the Da Vinci Science Center in Allentown. And it runs through February 10th. Take are $22 or less, and you can learn more at WNEP.com forward slash websites. Also with us is Troy A. Thrash, the CEO here at the Da Vinci Science Center. What do you think the little ones from Northeastern and Central Pennsylvania, if they take that drive, will really soak in here? Well, it, this exhibit gives an incredible understanding of, of what an amazing machine, an incredible machine that our human body is. And what they're going to do is be able to take away then the idea that there are some incredible careers here in the healthcare industry in Eastern Pennsylvania, and they have an an opportunity to really attain them if they work hard in math and science. A lot of good stuff and so many sights to see everything from the effect smoking has on the lungs to what a brain that maybe has suffered a stroke has looked like and we want to thank you guys for having us here this morning and by the way Tom we always say that people have connections back to our area. Miss Catherine lives in Atlanta but she married a guy from Carbondale who went to Lakeland High School. Yes he did Peter Seymour. We've been uh, married for quite a few years now. Who knows everyone has connections to our area Tommy boy. We love to hear love about it. them too. Thanks Ryan. See you later.